Hey guys, and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Dragon Warrior 3 with the Earthbound Crew. When we last left off, we went through the Tower of Najima and finally got everything we needed there and turned into Thief's Key. And then we went back to Alihan and talked to a couple of people, told us about in the village of Reeve, which we're in right now, is got the uh, magic ball that we need to advance. So that is our next goal, is to find the magic ball in this area. First things first, we're going to rest at the end. Uh, I'm not sure what we need for the turban, but I'm not gonna. I'm not sure if I need that. Well, we got the end right here, so let's do that. Probably wouldn't be a bad idea. And since we're already here, let's use the thief key right here. Let's see what's behind here. Alright, what do you have to say? If you journey east and go over the mountains, they say you'll find a small lake. That's our next goal, actually. So that actually gave us a clue of what we need to do next. This door deals with weapons and armor. Let's see. Uh, magic knife. Thorn whip. Chain sickle. Training suit. Let's do... Uh, a magic knife. We will give that to Tug. That's all I can afford right now. Alright, so let's equip the magic knife. Uh, let's not equip the magic knife on Tug. Apparently, um, he's stronger without a knife. Let's transfer that to Arabella, see if she can wield it. Okay, so that's good for Arabella. There we go. Anyway. Do -do -do. That's a horse, I thought that was a dog. Uh, we could have uh, could have used that on Hunter. On, but Hunter needs some agility, so all right. If you go up the stairs here, I've heard the story already. Go ahead and break the seal with this magic ball. So there's our magic ball. Then I'm gonna go back to the shop and I'm gonna sell to sell some old equipment that we don't need anymore, like the club and everything. Get some inventory space. I think we have to sell it from, uh... If we can't sell it, then I'm just gonna drop it. Alright, here we go. The Wayfarer's clothes. Yes. Hunter, let's sell the club. Tug, let's see. Nothing. Let's see. Does Arabella have anything to sell? Yeah, let's sell the club. Alright. There's really not too much more in here, but the, the one NPC was a clue what we're going to do next. Did you obtain the thief key? Yes. I'm glad about that. Welcome to the village of Reeve. Yep. It's not a big village either, so when you walk outside you may encounter things in suspicious places. It's not good enough to look from a distance to get up real close. And we've basically looked at the whole oh, we got this guy down here. Let's see what you gotta say. Hevo, no, it's way too heavy, it won't budge. Keep that in mind for later. Alright, I think we've explored the whole village of Reeve already. Yeah, it's not a big village. 
All right, so what we're going to do is start heading east. Far east. Arbella might actually be getting a little bit of a strength boost because of that magic. Yeah, look at that. Anyway. So we're going to be headed through some mountains. Uh, we get a new he the heal slab. Which really doesn't do too much but heal. See what I mean? <laughs> you gotta kill it. You hit it fast and you can do it. There we go. You gotta hit it faster than you can heal, so. Now I go up to the next level. Freeze by three. Agility up by three. Four Scorpion Wasps, okay. <sighs> Scorpion Wasps ain't too bad. As long as they don't ask, for, as long as they don't call out for friends. There we go. And Arabella goes up to the next level. Strength by two, agility by one, vitality by one, luck by three, intelligence by one, and MP goes up by two. Now, when we go through the mountains, there's gonna be a little bit of a, um, a little bit of a, um, Uh, Tog was poisoned. A little bit of uh, uh, encounter rate. That's what I'm trying to say. And then you are going to use an antidote herb on Tug. There we go. Well, this is good because we get a lot of HP. I mean, we're gonna get a lot of experience anyway, so it doesn't really matter. So anyway, here, there's a shrine down here. Four frog ores, okay. Honor! Good job! Anyway. There's a shrine right here. But you really isn't anything spectacular. Says, oh, young man, do you have the magic ball? Yes. You must go to the Cave of Enticement. You'll find it near a spring. Which is our next goal, which is just actually just northwest. We may just talk about that lake. It's right here. Mm -hmm. Alright, let's get rid of the babble first. There we go. That way we don't get freaking uh, poisoned. Alright, here we are. So it's our next little dungeon right here. We're supposed to be at level 9, we're a little under level, but I think we'll be alright. Alright, anyway. Where's our next little dungeon right here? Alright, let's see. This is the Cave of Enticement, but the sailway is sealed off by a stone wall. We need the magic ball for that. This is where the magic ball comes into play. Hunter sets up the magic ball on the wall. Boom! Hunter uses explosions! 
We don't have the magic ball anymore, so... Before we do that, let's heal up, uh... Tug. And let's also, um... Heal up myself. Alright, so now we're actually leaving the Alleyhan region and sitting and head off to a new region. Alright, here we have to be careful of those pits on the floor. And then we're, then we're knocking down to the basement and we have to climb back up, so. And we got a couple of new enemies up in this area, so. So we're gonna walk west into here. Oh, actually, we're gonna have to head north from here. Uh, we get a new, uh, two new enemies, Spike Tail, which is the uh, more powerful version of the Demon uh, Horn Hair, and the Demon Ant Eater, which is more powerful than the more powerful than the. Uh, Uh, the ma magic anteater. Ah. Uh. Okay, this isn't good. <sighs> Alright, we got one of the spike tears. Let's get rid of the scorpion wasp and let's get rid of the spike tear. Oh no. I think this is why they said we needed to be a, um... A little bit more powerful than, um... Level... The level I'm at right now. So what I'm gonna do... Is I'm gonna just stick around this area until I get about to about level 9. And then, uh... Then we'll go try that area again. So, it shouldn't really take me that long. I'm just gonna stick around here and uh, get to level 9. And just stick around Reeve so I can heal if I need to. I'll be back the rest at the end if I need to. But when I get back, I'll be at like level 8 or 9. And then we'll continue on to the um, cave enticement. So, and then maybe get some new equipment too, because I'm gonna get. Um, Get some new equipment and stuff like that too, so we're gonna go take care of that. That way we can get through this cave and get it to the next area. So I'm gonna end it here. It's a little bit of a shorter video, but I'm gonna level grind up a little bit, and then when we come back, we'll be, like I said, I'll be at level 9, probably some better equipment. I'll show off my equipment and stuff like that, and then uh, we'll, uh, uh, we'll uh, be ready to go. And we'll go to the cave of enticement. So when we get there, I'll be at the cave of enticement. So have a good day. I'll see y'all next time. Let's play Dragon Warrior 3. This is DKS3 and the Crazy Gamer. Sign out.